girl. Thought I would give y'all a tour of the house. Being Zelda's going to be over the next two weeks. Y'all get to see me and the babies and everybody else and what we've been up to. So here we go. Give me a second to get to the front of it. I don't have any ropes to pop this thing up. Okay, this is my front yard now. And this is the front of the house. Which I just love the doorways. And hi, you can see me in the window. <laughs> Sugar! Come on! Come on! Come on! Sorry about that. Dogs trying to escape. And there's like really strict laws around here. Anyways, this is the front entryway into the house. And then as we walk in, you will see the fireplace in the living room. And if I take an immediate right, you see into the door, that's going to be my bedroom. One of the many closets that I have, this one leads to the garage. That's my laundry room. You don't want to see it. This is my bedroom that they miss right now. Eventually, it'll all be painted purple. And Mike picked that color, not me. This is the master bath. Linen closet. My closet. Which is just huge. It's big enough for all of my clothes and my arts and crafts stuff, which is nice because I don't have an office. The shower. It's got seats for lazy people when we try to shave our legs. It's great. And this... Is Mike's closet. Notice how many clothes he has and the fact that he still has more than me and he's given away over half his clothes. The rest of our bathroom. Me again. Hi. Let's see, we'll go back out into the hallway. And this is the rest of our living room. The ceilings are huge in here. I think they're like 20 foot. We're going to paint in here a yellow color. It's going to be really nice. So walk through the living room and take a left. We will come to Haley's room, which, like I said, is still, everything's still in process. This is her closet. It's a nice walk in one. Okay, the best features of this house, though, like I told some people, are the closets. This is one, two, three, out of all the clo there's like ten closets in the house. This is one in the hallway. This is a another one in the hallway. This is the girls' bathroom. Just a cute little bathroom, but it has yet another closet which is just cool and then this taking immediate right out of the bathroom is going to be Kyla's room and we're going to paint it all vintage girl antique looking and her closet you can't really see it but it's there and that's the dog a little rut that I have to deal with every day. She's worse than my children. Let's see, let's go back into here where Haley is. And there's my monkey eating her pancakes for the morning. Say hi. Ah, can I go say hi. This is the dining room area. Hopefully, it'll be big enough to fit the table and the china cabinet. And this is my kitchen, the only part of the house that is actually unpacked and organized at this particular point. I don't know, I'm one of the weird ones. My clothes come last and the kitchen comes first. And this is my pantry. I'm so happy. I actually have room for the first time in my life to put all of my food. Compared to the last one which was cram packed and couldn't fit anything else, I have plenty of space. Hey, monkey! Hi! Are they good? 
careful, you're going to fall out. And then we will step out the back door onto our deck, which is great. You don't have to build one of those. Our property line runs all the way to the edge of that fence. And then you can see where the grass ends. That's our property line. So it's, I think it's 80 feet deep from the front of the house to the backyard. And then if you walk this way, <coughs> our property line runs all the way to those other side of those trees. That first line right there. We have all this side yard to play in and put gardens. And then all of this yard which runs up into the ditch. So it's a huge, huge lot. We got really lucky because most places would put another house right there and give us no space at all. But that is my house. I hope y'all enjoy and maybe one day somebody can come see me. Bye!